find out what the landscape is like and why, unless you're a national automaker, you might need a little help to sell cars in China. So China's become the number one new car auto market in the world. Uh, last year, 2011, 14 million passenger cars, 18 and a half million total new vehicles sold. So past Japan several years ago, past the U.S. a couple of years ago, and, and, and we'll never look back. It'll always be the, the largest new car market in the world. And, uh, and big in every way. When I first went to uh, China in 2005, there were probably three to 4,000 dealers. Today there's 20,000. Every OEM in the whole world is there, so not just the uh, Chinese manufacturers and, and the Asian and uh, U.S., but also European manufacturers are there, too. They have a lot of control uh, over the dealers, um, but the franchise system works fairly similar to the way it works in the U.S. To work in China, you really have to have a partner, and so uh, the OEMs are primarily joint ventures, so you'll have... Uh, uh, Beijing Hyundai, for example, or FAW Toyota, or Shanghai GM. And these are um, joint ventures between an entity in China and the global OEM. Mm -hmm. And uh, uh, the only ones that aren't that way are the domestic Chinese themselves, the, the, you know, like Geely and uh, you know, those uh, Great Wall and some of those companies.